guys welcome back to my channel and if you're new here welcome so today we are doing one of my absolute favorite videos to film I'm gonna be doing a Timu best finds video if you've never watched one of these Timu best find videos from me before basically I'm just showing you what I think is actually worth purchasing off of Timu stuff that I love and stuff that I would highly highly recommend I also do have multiple of these videos and I do have them in a playlist if you guys want to go back and watch those everything will be linked down below along with all the products that I show here today so if you're interested in anything that I show everything will be down in the description bar but anyways enough chit chat let's go ahead and get into this video okay so I want to start off with an item that I actually just recently picked up if you watched my last Timu haul I believe it is and you will probably recognize this but it is this beautiful checker print blanket I'll show you guys up close so you can see here it is absolutely gorgeous and oh my gosh you guys it is the softest material ever material wise and quality wise it's a really really great dupe for the barefoot dreams blanket it's funny when I first hauled this blanket I'm pretty sure in that video I said this might be one of my favorite items that I've ever got from Timu and honestly you guys I still stand by that this is amazing it is seriously a 10 out of 10 if I could give it a higher rating I would that's how much I love it and also I just want to mention how this came packaged it was beautiful I'll insert a picture right here my first thought when I saw this was how awesome would this be as a Christmas gift like the packaging was just gorgeous and honestly who doesn't like getting a blanket as a Christmas gift and also if you're not into these kinds Colors. They did also have other ones as well. So I believe they had pink, they had I think a green color, they had black and white, and then they had another one as well, which I can't remember. It might have been a darker brown or maybe a gray, but I just really gravitated to this kind of khaki beige color. I thought it was really nice, and I love how it's so neutral as well. I just figured it would kind of go with anything. I really was debating though between this one and the pink one, just because if you know me, then you know I love the color pink, but I may just have to go back and get that one too. I don't know, but <laughs> that's just how much I love these blankets. They do say on Timu that this is a 50 by 60 blanket, and honestly, it seems a little bit bigger than that to me. It's a great size blanket. I love it. If you're looking for a good blanket, a good Christmas gift, just something to buy for yourself, I don't know, this is such a great blanket. I honestly cannot get over it. It's beautiful, obviously, just to have as decor, throw it over your bed, throw it over your couch, um, even a chair, or even have it in like a basket or something like that. But obviously as well, this is so comfy and nice to cover up in. The material is so soft, I love it. So yeah, this is definitely an amazing find. Like I said, if you're looking for a good blanket, definitely check this one out. All right, the next item that I'm gonna show you guys, I am absolutely in love with. It's so cute. It is Christmassy. I believe it's the only kind of Christmas item that I have here today, but it is this adorable pillowcase cover. Look at this, you guys. So it has little gingerbread man all over it. And they're kind of like, I don't know if you guys can tell, but they're like 3D and then this really cool material. Then it does have these tassels on it as well, but this is such a nice pillowcase cover like I really can knock it over it how nice this actually is the material is really really thick on this surprisingly now obviously this is just the cover the pillow in it does not come with it but I cannot get over how cute this is and I just personally love also how neutral it is as well obviously there is a little bit of a darker red here but I just like how it's not like super in your face Christmassy you know what I mean I actually have quite a few pillowcase covers from Timu now and I'm pleasantly surprised they're really great quality especially for the price and I feel like sometimes also when it comes to like kind of trendier seasonal items like this they tend to be more expensive but like I said super impressed with the price super impressed with the quality and you just cannot beat how adorable and cute this pillow is. All right, next I wanna talk about another home decor item and it is this adorable little lamp right here. Look how cute this is up close, you guys. I love the rattan bottom and then the really nice pleated lampshade. I just think this is so cute. So this is a plug-in lamp, so it's not cordless or anything like that. I only say that because I do have some of the cordless lamps from Timu, but this one does have the cord. And then you have this part right here. So this is just where you control it. So obviously turn it off and on. And then you do have the part right here where you can like make it a little bit more dim, a little bit more bright. I can't get over how cute this is. It is so adorable. Obviously it's definitely not a big lamp by any means, but it's actually really nice either in like a kitchen or even like a laundry room or something like that or even like on your makeup desk would be really nice as well. I think it's honestly just so aesthetically pleasing and I love any kind of like rattan or wood tones and just obviously 
crazy. As I've said before, I love neutral things, so this is right up my alley. And I also love the light that this gives off as well. I will include a clip of me turning this on to show you guys. But I just love this. I seriously think it's such a great buy and it would be the perfect addition to your home. So I think what I'm gonna show you next here, I believe it's the last kind of home decor piece. I think so anyways, but it's these beautiful stems. Now they might be hard to see right now, but take my word for it, these are gorgeous. They're this really nice, rich eggplant color. As you guys can see, they're also like very, very large as well. And you do get three of them. I can honestly say every single pick or stem that I've got from Timu, I love. And also like, I can't get over the quality as well. Um, my dad actually thought that these were real. So <laughs> they were in a vase, he was like, are those real? But uh, no, they're fake. They just look very realistic. They're gorgeous. I also have these in a really, really beautiful red color as well, which I'll pop up on the screen. But out of every like stem or pick that I've got from Timu, these are probably my favorite. I don't know what it is about them, but I just love them. And I pretty much just took these out of the vase because I had them up for like fall and Halloween. And I just feel like they are the perfect kind of like fall stem, but I seriously am in love with these. The red ones as well are beautiful. I don't know which color I like the best, there's something about this eggplant color though. I I don't know, I just am obsessed with it. <laughs> if you're into these stems and picks, but you prefer something that looks a little bit more realistic, I definitely recommend these, they're absolutely gorgeous. But also just in general, you guys, if you're looking for any kind of stem, definitely check out Timu because they have a really great selection. And like I said, everything that I've got from them, I love. These are another one of my favorite buys from Timu. I love them. And that would be these fuzzy Birkenstock dupes. So that's what they look like up close there. I did haul these, I believe, in my last video, I think. And in case you missed that video, here they are. That's what they look like up close. And honestly, you guys, these are such a great dupe for the actual fuzzy Birkenstocks. Like I said in my other video, the only big difference would be how thick the like fuzzy fur is on them, but that's about it. And obviously these are a fraction of the price of the real ones. And I feel like the camera's just not really picking up the color that well, but they're this really pretty kind of khaki taupe, and then they do have the gold buckle right there. Also, these are just so comfy, you guys. I love them. When I first got them, I didn't realize how comfortable these actually are. They're basically like a slipper, pretty much. <laughs> they do have a hard sole bottom, but they're basically a slipper. Now, I will say one thing about these, though, is that they do run a little bit small, so I just went ahead and sized up, and they fit great, so if you're thinking about getting these, I would just size up one size. But these are just so awesome. I love them. Such a great dupe, such a great fall shoe. I've seriously been wearing them nonstop because they're so comfy and they look so cute. And I also got my mom hooked on these, so she got a pair as well. But yeah, I just love these. And honestly, I just feel like everybody needs a pair of fuzzy Birkenstock dupes in their life. <laughs> Might as well show the other pair of shoes that I have here. And that would be these stunning boots. These are seriously amazing, you guys. Like, look at these up close. Insane. I really don't even have much to say other than these are freaking gorgeous. Like, I'm obsessed with these. Like, they just remind me so much of a really expensive shoe. That's the look they gave off to me without obviously paying the expensive price. The quality on these is insane, you guys. So good. I wore these for hours the other day. And even though the heel is like not incredibly high, it's actually, you know, a decent size heel. These were super comfy and I wore these, like I said, for hours. And I feel like everybody just kind of needs like that classic go-to black heeled boot to have in the winter time. And these are mine, for sure. Like, these are my go-to black heels. Love them. If you guys watch my Timu hauls, then you probably already know this, but I'm obsessed with purses and I'm obsessed with shoes. So, I wanted to show you guys one of my best finds for purses, and that would be this one right here. This is absolutely gorgeous, you guys. So, it's a faux denim purse. Let me show you up close here so you can see all the details. And then, this is what the strap looks like right there. This is definitely one of my go-to bags. I love it so much. Whenever I, like, post a picture with this or, like, show it in an outfit video or something like that, I always get comments on where this is from. And I'm like, Timo. It's on Timo. I wouldn't say this bag is necessarily like a dupe of anything specific, but it really gives me like Chanel vibes and also gives me YSL vibes. And I just, I'm obsessed with it. I think it's seriously the cutest thing ever. And it actually does have quite a bit of room in there. Yes, I have my gum in here right now. And also the inside of it is like a really kind of vibrant orangey red, which I think is really cool. The straps, you could either do it short like this or you can pull it down and make it long, but I just prefer to have it shorter like this. And it's funny because when I first got this bag, I kind of figured like this is not gonna be something that I wear very often or, you know, on the daily, just because it is a, you know, blue faux denim. So I, I figured like, you know, it's probably 
not gonna go with too many different outfits, but surprisingly, I wear this actually quite a bit, and surprisingly, it does go with a lot of different outfits. So yeah, this is something that I reach for quite often. I love it. It's really great quality. I've had this for a little bit now, and like I said, I do use it pretty often, and it still looks the exact same as when I first got it. If you're looking for a good bag, and maybe you wanna switch it up and do something that's not super neutral, I definitely recommend this one. Like I said, it's, a little bit out there, but also something you can wear on the daily as well. Okay, this next thing here I wanted to show with the home decor, but I just kind of forgot about it. But it's one of these electric lighters. So this is what it looks like up close here. There it is. So you just slide this piece up right there, the lights come on, and then this button right here is what actually turns the flame on. So I don't know if you guys will be able to see it on camera or not, but that's what it looks like. But it's actually really neat. Like, I really like this. I've wanted one of these for quite some time, and I just didn't pick one up. And honestly, these can be pretty pricey. So when I saw it on Timu, I was like, yep, I'm grabbing that. But I just think it's so cool. I also really like the color of it. It's a nice kind of like muted gold. And then it does have a little charging port at the bottom there, if you guys can see that. But I just personally think this is a lot better than just like your typical lighter for lighting like your candles and stuff like this. And it just makes it easier too, where it is so long. You don't have to accidentally burn your thumb or anything. I just think it's a fun little gadget to have and it's also very useful as well. Okay, next I want to go ahead and chat about this guy right here. So this is what it looks like. It's just a little wallet or card holder, whatever you want to call it. And this is a really, really great dupe of the Stella McCartney ones. It basically looks spot on. It's pretty much exactly the same. There's a couple like very small differences, but it's basically the exact same. It just opens like that. It is a very tiny wallet, so I believe there's only like four slots in there, but I just pretty much use it for like the cards that I absolutely need. And it's also really great as well if you're going out somewhere and you don't really wanna bring like a big wallet or a big purse. This is awesome for that. And it also does have a slot at the top there for like cash. But this is like my everyday wallet that I use. Um, like I said, I pretty much just keep like my go-to cards in there that I need. And I just love it. I love the way it looks. I think it's so pretty. They do have quite a few different colors for this wallet, but I just decided to go with black because you know, it goes with everything. I'm very basic, so I just wanted to go with black. But they also do have a really pretty kind of metallic -y silver as well. That one's super cute too. But yeah, I love this wallet. It's also great quality. The material is like, very soft surprisingly and I love the chain detail. I, I don't know, I just think it's such a pretty wallet and I love how great of a dupe this is. Probably one of the best dupes that I've ever found on Timu, honestly. This one's a little bit random, but I have to talk about it because it's so good. So this is a electric razor or electric clipper, hair clipper. I'm not really sure what you want to call it, but this is what it looks like right here. And it does come with three different blades. So you have two here and then I have one that's on there. And also the charging cord as well, along with a cleaning brush. So I don't actually use this for me. <laughs> I use this actually for my dog. So I grew my dog at home and this is amazing. If you are looking for a good hair clipper, hair trimmer, whatever these are called, I can never figure out what the actual name of these are, but this is insanely good and for such a good price. These are normally so expensive. I know I've actually went to the pet store and checked out the actual like dog clippers. They are so expensive, like insane. This one I believe was under 30, I think it was somewhere around that and it's so good you guys. So this is what it looks like up close I have <laughs> groomed Tang with this so if you see a little bit of fur in there don't mind that that's from Tang <laughs> But this is what it looks like. I also love how sleek this is as well It's really nice and one thing I really appreciate as well is how quiet these are so I'm gonna turn it on so you guys can hear it might have sounded a little bit loud on camera, but I promise you guys, they're actually very quiet for clippers. And that's one thing for Tang, my dog, he does not like the sound of clippers. So when I realized how quiet these were, I was like, yes, that's awesome. And they just work so good. I cannot get over how good these work compared to like some really expensive clippers that I've used in the past. This is way better. Okay, next, this is another one of my favorites, you guys. And as soon as I got this, I knew it would end up in one of my best finds videos and now it is. So it's this beautiful robe. It's probably going to be a little bit hard to show, but it's a super comfy robe. It also is decently long as well. And it has the cutest cherry print on it. If you guys can see that, it's so adorable. I love it. So it has little hearts and cherries. And I think I said this when I hauled it, but I wish you guys could feel this. It is incredibly soft. Like I cannot get over how soft this is and cozy. Now what I will say you guys, it's definitely not a thick robe. So if you're buying it and expecting it to be thick, it's not gonna be, it's definitely on the thinner side, but what it lacks for in thickness, it makes up for in comfort. This is the comfiest robe that I own. And if you know me, I own a lot of robes. <laughs> I am a little bit robe obsessed, but 
This is probably my favorite rope that I own now. I've been wearing it nonstop. I've also washed this probably four times now and it's held up great. Sometimes I find once you start washing your robes over and over again, just the material really starts to wear down and they're just not as comfy, but this has held up great. It's still just like the day that I got it and I just cannot get over this. I love it so much. I also think this would make an amazing Christmas gift as well. I've definitely seen some robes on Tima that just don't really look the greatest. They look kind of cheap and just not very comfortable, but this one has completely exceeded my expectations. So soft, so comfy. I cannot get enough of it. Once this video is done, this is going to be on. <laughs> I'm telling you right now, this will be on. Okay, next I want to chat about these leggings right here. So I actually hauled these quite some time ago now, but I really wanted to do like a good wear test on these before I ever included them in a video like this. And they definitely passed the test, as you guys can tell, they're in a video, but uh, these are really great leggings, you guys. And these are also supposed to be a dupe of the Lululemon leggings. And I can honestly say now, I really do believe that they are. These just feel so great on. They're really great quality. They're super soft. They're comfy. They're not see-through, which is a big thing. I cannot stand when leggings are see-through. And these are definitely not see-through. What I love about these also is that they're super high-waisted. So they do have a really thick band on them right here. So obviously they do come up pretty high, but they kind of like suck you in at the same time without feeling uncomfortable. I feel like a lot of things that are super high-waisted and are meant to kind of suck you in, they're just super uncomfortable. You just feel like you can't move around. They're really restricting but these I cannot get over how comfortable these are and they're also very flattering as well because like I said they do suck everything in and another thing as well when I first got these I was looking at the length and I was like oh please don't be short on me so these actually hit me like right at the ankle so that's completely fine with me anything shorter than that I'm like no not for me I just feel like it looks kind of strange on me but yeah I cannot say enough good things about these leggings you guys if you're looking for a good Lululemon dupe definitely check these ones out and also what I love as well is that they have a bunch of different colors so if you want to try something a little bit different from the standard black leggings they have a bunch to pick from all right and my last best finds are both earrings so I'm going to try to show these kind of quickly and kind of just both at the same time so these are the first pair right here as you guys can see they are like a two-tone gold and silver these are gorgeous the next ones here I'm gonna try to show these as best as I can but these ones are kind of like a dupe for the Van Cleef earrings these are absolutely stunning the reason why I picked both of these earrings to include in my best finds video is because I love these I wear them non-stop I'm either reaching for these or these and I find also whenever I post like either pictures or videos in these I always get compliments on them and I always get people asking where they're from another thing as well with these super affordable like you genuinely cannot beat the price so far they have not turned at all I've had these ones for way longer than these ones right here and these still look like the same as the day that I got them and again with these as well same exact thing. I do buy a lot of jewelry from Timu, especially earrings. Earrings are probably like my favorite thing to wear. But like I said, something about these two, I reach for them all the time. They're my go-tos and they're just gorgeous. Like I really cannot say enough good things about these. All right, you guys, so that is actually gonna be it for today's Timu's Best Finds videos. Like always, if you wanna see more of these videos, just let me know and I can definitely do some more. Also let me know if maybe you'd be interested in seeing like a Christmas gift guide video from Timu because I could definitely do that as well. But anyways, I really hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Video. If you did, don't forget to give it a big like and subscribe because I would really appreciate that. Also, if you want to go ahead and keep up with me outside of YouTube, I do have TikTok and Instagram and I'll go ahead and link those down below. But anyways, I hope you guys have a great day and I'll see you in my next video. Bye guys.